Hello, my name is Maria Kubanis, and today I will be talking to you all about mixed dementia. I will be talking about why mixed dementia is a national health priority area. This presentation will also show the prevalence and incidence of mixed dementia, global trends in Australia, and some interesting facts. The purpose of this of this presentation is to educate you all about this disease and how it is quite common in elderly people so you are aware of the side effects and the problems that come along with it. So mixed dementia is a condition where changes representing more than one type of dementia occur simultaneously in the brain. So the two most common diseases that are associated with mixed dementia are Alzheimer's disease and vascular dementia. Mixed dementia is a national health priority area, which is also known as an NHPA, because it is a common and public disease among the elderly and it is increasing rapidly in numbers every year and is becoming quite, quite severe. Okay, so worldwide, around 50 million people have dementia, with nearly 60% of these people are living in low and middle income countries. And every year, there are nearly about 10 million new cases. This disease is very, very common in people age 60 and over. And as you can see in this graph, um, dementia is rapidly increasing and becoming a more severe condition. So the prevalence in Australia, according to Servalati C, the 20, sorry, this data reveals that there is currently an estimated 459,000 people living with all forms of dementia. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. This is likely to increase to 1,076,000 people by 2058. Younger onset dementia is dementia within younger people is described it is it is um okay sorry so younger onset dementia is pe younger people that have dementia and one form of dementia this is for people under the age of 65 and there is an estimated 27,800 people living with this dementia and without a major breakthrough this number is um, to increase to 41,250 people by 2058. Um, in 2020, there is an estimated 400, 459,000 Australians living with dementia, and without a medical breakthrough, the number of people with dementia is expected to increase to 590,000 by 2028, and 1,076,000 by 2058. Currently, an estimated 250 people are joining in the population with dementia every single day. Someone, oh, so uh, the incidence globally, someone in the world develops dementia every three seconds. And already from this graph, 58% of people with dementia live in low and middle income countries. But by 2050, this will rise to 68%. The fastest growth in the elderly population is taking place in China and India. So the most interesting fact that I found from this whole, from this whole disease is that someone in the world develops dementia every three seconds. That is just crazy. Um, and I can relate to how devastating that would be because as my grandmother has had mixed dementia for a few years now, but recently my grandfather has been showing symptoms of dementia and it is very, very hard to watch and very sad and devastating. 
So yeah, this was the most interesting fact. Thank you for listening, guys. And I hope you learned something about dementia and mixed dementia. And I hope you can um, see the symptoms now.